Okay, today what we have here is a plastic floor we're putting down, okay? See, it comes in uh, two by two panels, and they can be individually pulled apart. You can cut the stuff and fit it around all the little pieces or imperfections in your garage. Um, your floor doesn't need to be 100% flat. If there's little bumps and stuff like that, or little cracks in the floor, you just kind of put some filler in them. And as you see, you can just, you gotta leave a little bit of a gap around there so that you have a little bit of expansion. But this stuff's really nice. It's, uh, I'll say without putting an epoxy down, it's very transformative. Uh, in a really fast, short order, you can pretty much change your, the look of your garage to more of a professional and clean look, a shop look. So, we hope that you, uh, we like these panels and uh, hope that you yourself as a DIYer can get out there and the situation will say <clears throat> that you too can do this floor. You can put this floor down. It's just a matter of getting the hang of it. There's a male and a female tab. Okay, and then what you do is you just go through It's that simple. And uh, what I'm also using, I got a table saw outside for the long cuts, but here's what I'm using for any of the little cuts. I just use a little multi-tool. And it also you can buy like the one square foot of it. So if you need pieces and parts, you can go around things. But that's what we've got today. And that's the situation that says by the end of maybe a couple hours, we'll have this floor done and the homeowner will be uh, ready to pull in on it with his automobile and feel a little bit cleaner. It'll be easy to clean up stuff, any messes. And as you see, it's got a, it's two-sided. It's got a male end and a female end. And then underneath, you see where they lock in. Um, they say don't use a, a you know, use a rubber hammer, don't use a metal hammer, but the rubber hammer just seems to bounce around a lot more. And you see how nice, as long as you're hitting it evenly, you're not over striking it, the metal hammer works just fine. So if you want to transform your garage floor, this might be a product that says, I believe in it. All right, we'll give you an update on it as we uh, put a little wear and tear on it. This is Bry over here at the DIY School of Hard Knocks coming at you.